Mr. Peabody, an unidentified rolling object is heading towards the penitentiary. A coat of arms with a crown? That's a royal carriage. Open the door. Oh, the pretty kennel with curtains on the windows. Her Royal Highness Queen Victoria from Royal England. Your Majesty. Come on, everyone, back to the Queen. Instead of acting like ninnies, you should be thinking of a way out of here. Huh? I don't believe it. They left the doors wide open. Let's go. <laughs> Her Royal Highness has been escorted by the army during a royal visit, but we got lost in the middle of the desert. Pardon my indiscretion, but the Queen looks rather sad. Her Majesty is feeling rather homesick for England, and she hasn't laughed for months. What a tremendous privilege receiving a prestigious visitor such as yourself in our humble penitentiary. Hmm? Close the door! <laughs> <laughs> Avril, you big ninny! Oh, what a spiffingly hilarious little man. Be sure to bring this gnome to my apartment so he can entertain me. Allow me to point out to your royal highnesses and that one is dealing with a prisoner of the worst sort. <laughs> Hold your horses! You want me to be that frilly costume queen's clown? <laughs> Ooh, I, yes, I agree. Here's the plan. One, we steal the jewels and two, we get out of here while everyone is scraping and bowing to Miss Britt. <laughs> while waiting for your carriage to be mended, all of the prisoners will do their utmost to ensure that your royal highness feels at home. Gentlemen, it's tea time! <laughs> <laughs> One, two, three! Ugh. One, uh -huh. two, three! <laughs> ah. He is highly amusing. <laughs> you, quickly now, would you help him up? It would seem that your majesty's buffoon has disappeared. Ah. Huh? Come on, I've got the necklace. Let's go! Oh, no, Joe, no, yeah, we're about to have pudding and muffins. Uh -huh. huh? This is a great kennel. Huh? Oh, no, it's not a kennel. It's a loony bin. Uh, Miss Betty, the pudding is ready. <laughs> <laughs> Cuckoo? What have you been up to, you naughty little boy? Well, it's obvious, isn't it? We're escaping with your jewels. With the royal jewels? <laughs> well, then, carry on, lads. I'm watching. Don't you worry, your highnessism. I shall lock up these bandits in the dungeon. Uh, uh, security, sir. Oh, no, you're spoiling everything. I want to witness a true escape. If that is your desire, your majesty. Ta-da! Isn't it weird how the queen let you take her necklace? Oh, no, she's probably got another one, that's all. However, we now have to find an intelligent way to get out of here. <laughs> Well, this is bizarre. Stop thinking and follow me. This is more and more bizarre. Yoo-hoo! Anyone there? Where are you? An escape in the royal carriage. Is this classy or what? I still think it's bizarre. Yeah! Oh, no! The Dodgers are being sent to an asylum! We're free! And we're rich! That's the escape of the century! <laughs> Hello! Surprise! What 
shall we do next? Shall we rob a bank? Attack a train? You're no queen. You're a pain in the behind. Yeehaw! <laughs> do that again. I love it. Luckily, I'm here to save them. Let's go. <laughs> Is everything all right, Your Majesty? Shall I punish these criminals? <laughs> Relax, everything is spiffing. That was so much fun. I do hope the escape was to your Royal Highness's taste, and you managed to witness the fugitive's capture as well. Absolutely, that was jolly good. <laughs> I have found my joie de vivre again, thanks to my little stay with you. I have decided to give the Dalton Clown and his brothers a knighthood. But where's my favorite little buffoon? Oh, don't you worry, Your Highness. He's resting in the infirmary. What a shame. I would have loved to have brought him back with me to England. <laughs> Toodle! I was the richest man in the world. I was free. And now look. No! Still, Joe's really lucky to be in such a warm, comfy, and well-decorated carriage. We don't get to welcome a lot of famous people, let alone a famous opera singer every day. As fabulous as Greta Wunderbar. What luck she chose to stop here during her world tour. Oh, hear that, guys? There's a creme de la creme. Ooh, I love ice cream. Not cream, you ninny. It means a famous singer's coming here, so we take a hostage and hello freedom. <laughs> I see the stage, coach. Here at last. Oh, most divine diva. Welcome to my humblest town. Allow me to kidnap the... <laughs> I mean, <laughs> allow me to help you down. Jack, William Avril, get the ladies' baggage. What delicate attention. Come, Gunther. Uh... This is cool. They delivered our Christmas turkey. As you can see, oh. everything here is ordered for peace and quiet. The poor men, let me encourage them. The land of the free. No, that turkey must have sunstroke oh. screaming like that. Gotta do something fast. Now's our chance. The home of the Change of plan, guys. Her voice does the trick. Look at that! Oh, bravo! Louder! Fraulein, careful. Your voice is delicate. <laughs> Phew! I see the Christmas dinner. <laughs> An attack. Keep away from her, everyone. This is a terrible mistake. That's all right. It's nothing. <laughs> <laughs> Another plan bites the dust. <laughs> Your tea is ready. Thank you, Miss Betty. Now with this, you'll soon recover your... your fabulous... Uh... Leave that to me. You will burn her throat. I was first. <laughs> Let's not spend all night. <laughs> well done. There goes our last pot of honey. We need to find something else. Thanks to Oriental Medicine, Ice Woman will sing again like a nightingale on Cherry Blossom Tree. You're certain this isn't dangerous? Of course not. This'll make her feel as bright as it. <laughs> <laughs> this primitive doctor does not convince me. Actually, he often helps out. Right, Pete? Yeah. Huh? Mm hmm. Most unusual. Catching a cold in the desert. Fabulous Falcon must experiment to find the remedy. Any volunteers? Us! Us! Oh, delicious! Yuck! The 
This is disgusting! Mm. No effect on me. <laughs> Here, taste this and you'll set the world on fire. Don't drink it. You, uh, you try it first. <laughs> well, it's just that I'm actually allergic to... Hand that over. Someone has to sacrifice himself for the love of music. Ah. <laughs> oh, it's most invigorating. Astonishing! But my voice, it's fantastic! However, can I thank you? How about a little concert in the yard for all the prisoners? They so desperately need one. What a good idea, Joe. Yes, indeed. Excellent. Thank you. Thank you all for coming. You are so very marvelous! In a few minutes, the Daltons are going to invent a new style of escape. Is that it? If she sings like that, we won't escape! The turkey's singing a farewell song. That is so moving. I'll sing along too! Fantastic! Go for it! Keep it up! Not now! Nobody interrupts the great Greta Wunderbar! If you love me not, I only care. And if, if I love you, then you'd best beware! Best beware! If I love you, if I love you, then you'd, you'd beware! Just look, isn't it beautiful freedom? Bravo, bravo, oh, encore. You'd Fraulein, it was a great honorism to have you here. Oh. Love, oh, love is a cactus flower. Ka -ka 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 there goes the creme de la creme. Oh, yeah? Cream? How come I didn't get any? <laughs> Dear inmates, let me introduce Jimmy Jim. The government has commissioned him to design a new uniform for you all. Four handsome inmates will be chosen to go on tour to present the new collection. On tour sounds like escape. Fine. So who wants to cast for this? There's four of us, and we're cute. Hang on, oh. I'm cute too. You need to be more than cute. You need to know how to walk. Watch. Oh. Like this? No, oh, a military march. I love the army. Such natural style. I'm including these four as candidates. <laughs> Let's see. Sizes are XL, L, M, and Child. Ah! You'll compete with these four. You place your feet in line, swing your shoulders and hips from side to side, a sultry look, and a wild swing around. Your turn. Oh, oh, oh. Oh. Exercise two. Now we're going to work on posture. <laughs> Joe, your eyes have to say to the jury, love me. <laughs> Time to try out your outfits, hop up. I can't wear this. You're magnificent. Go on, walk ahead.
I'm the terror of the West. I'm the terror of the West. Hey, don't walk in front of me. No. Oh, ah. that. You'll mess up your hair. Let's prepare the contest. Tomorrow, you'll walk two by two. Ugly Bob's team on the right. And the losers on the left. <laughs> <laughs> okay, back to good old methods. Sabotage. Gentlemen, tomorrow we're out of here. <laughs> William Dalton versus Shaggy George. <laughs> Jake Dalton versus Skinny Bear. One, two, one, two, look. Marching's hard to win four balls instead of two. Uh. Emerald Dalton versus Tubular Hugger. <laughs> Joe Dalton versus Ugly Bomb. Campaign at last. We get rid of Pete and Emmett and we take off. Ooh la la, what happened to you? Your face is all covered in bumps there. What? Stop! <laughs> Hold on. Ooh. Here we go. It's here! Let's go get clothes from the Indians. We'll be spotted 10 miles away like this. Ow! Oh. What's that? Ten miles ahead. Looks like tourists. Right. Get on your costumes and set up shop. We're getting business. Yeah. Yeah. Get it! Be quiet. Okay. This is a surprise attack. Um, oh. 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 Oh, they're so oh, they're handsome. So Why are the squaws <laughs> giving us funny looks? They are so handsome. <laughs> What do they want? I prefer not to know. What on earth is that cloud of dust? Our guards chased by the Daltons, chased by scars. Chased by Green Team Dom? <laughs> we escaped the squaws! I was the terror of the West! <laughs> you mean I really can't go yet? Not until you teach us the witchcraft that makes our squaws crazy. Stars again. Walk, look, turn! Careful with those eyes, sultry eyes, gentlemen. <laughs> and one and two. Back straight, please. Now make an effort or I'm going to whip you. I'm getting out my whip. You're infuriating. Which means... Uh... Indians have attacked them, but they managed to escape through the desert. The gentlemen's are mute. 
They desire hospitalityism for the night. <laughs> Please be welcome, uh, Mr... Uh. Hmm? St. Bernard? <laughs> Bernardo, sorry. Oh, Italians! Always use their hands when they talk. Oh, here comes the pizza chef. <laughs> Don Chego de la Vega. I am a Mexican gentleman. If we lay hands on that guy's guns, we'll be long gone. <laughs> uh, is it Halloween tonight? Ah, oh, curses! Huh? You have discovered my secret. Don't you dare tell anyone that the innocent Don Diego is actually... Zorro. Hmm? So who's this shuk shuk Zorro? The masked avenger who fights injustice and defends the oppressed. With that barbecue poker? <laughs> <laughs> tell me another one. <laughs> So you were saying you defend the oppressed? And that nasty governor, he oppresses poor innocent guys like us. In fact, we're so oppressed, we're depressed. That wicked tyrant, he unjustly accused you to steal your ascendas. See, si, Hernando, this is a mission for so, so, sorrow. <laughs> Oh, that Italian guy's so big! But he really ought to ease up with the pizzas. <laughs> What's oh. that supposed to be? My name, it is the sign of the X. An X that stands for sorrow. Uh -huh. uh -huh. Sorrow! Boss, an unidentified bandit snug inside a penitentiary. A certain shit shit Zorro. Hmm, that's odd. They usually want to sneak out. I tried to catch him, but this guy was faster than the lightning. He was big, like this high, with an accent and a thin mustache. Mysterism. Keep your eyes peeled. This could be a DEA, a disguised escape attempt. Him again? Oh. Watch out! Sorrow is here! Ah! Ah! We're supposed to go that way, you ninny! Sorrow! <laughs> what is all this racket? No! <laughs> God, stop that man in black! Too late, Senor Director! Mm. That devilish sorrow has escaped! Every time sorrow turns up, Mr. De La Vega appears there. Hmm. Mr. Peabody suspects you. That makes this game trickier. But I've got a plan to convince him you're not sorrow. Mm. <laughs> Ta-da! <laughs> Don't let him out of your sight. I am the master avenger and I'm setting free all the oppressed people. Only. But then you're not. Shook, shook. Mm -mm. Okay, it's time for you to disappear. No! He's there! Uh -huh. My name, it is the sign of the X. An X that means sorrow. The keys! Bingo! I know say my famous line. 
Sun. My name is Sun of the X, and X stands for Emerald. <laughs> that poor Italian guy is really too skinny. The master fencer? It was Avril? But when did he learn to fence? Miss Betty, nothing surprises me when it comes to the Daltons. Los Daltons? The terrible banditos who are so nasty and so stupid? You understand, Bernardo? This was all an evil trick. And to think I suspected this distinguished gentleman. What an injusticeism. <laughs> <laughs> I really love Italian people. They're so warm-blooded. <laughs> la, 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 yeah.